hi babes this is a very quick tutorial of how to go from that to this just juicy coils at the end of your braid so you're going to pick um, a few number of braids I use four or five the number of braid you you get at once is going to determine how coily the coils are going to be so um, once you gather the hair you can use any string that is not stretchy so here i am using brazil wool and if the the string is a little bit thick it helps to make the job easier so when you gather the hair you wrap the thread or the string several times on one location to secure it so when once it is secured and you're sure it's not going to move you're going to start moving downwards the way i am doing here the distance between each circle of the thread as you wind it around is going to determine how loose again the coils are going to be so if you want really tight coils you can coil like two of the braids and make the distance in between the circles as you're going around with your string make it smaller it's going to make the coils tighter if you want looser braids looser coils you gather a whole bunch of hair and while going around don't make the distance between what i am doing now too small it's going to make the coils to be more like beach waves type of coils I understand once you get to the end you're just going to squish up the hair extension through the thread just push it up it's going to bunch up like that then you secure it so that it doesn't loosen up then you can place it in hot water i prefer using small mugs like this because i can control where the water is going once you remove the hair let it sit in for about 20 seconds once you bring it out make sure it is landing on a towel in your hands and even when you are done damping the water do not let the hair fall on the person's scalp because it's still going to be hot so watch where you drop it once you are done with that and the hair is cool start off by taking cutting off the thread from the area where we secured it when you were starting that place that we wound it several times cut that off stretch the coil um sorry you can't stretch it at that point cut that part off then cut off the bottom part stretch the hair like this and just cut off the bottom part so you're cutting both the tip of the hair extensions you're cutting off where you made that knot at the end so it's just like trimming the hair at once instead of losing that knot and then going back to cut the tip of the hair just cut it at once and this is what you get so from your braids you can make this for a child make it kind of scanty you can make it for an adult that wants a free airy hair and if you want it really full you can make fuller braids with tighter coils or you can make fewer braids with looser coils whatever you want but that's the technique behind it thank you for watching don't forget to leave a thumbs up and a comment if you're the best <laughs> take care bye